Hi, this is Roger. Thanks for dropping by. Very quick video. Some strange weather at the moment. We've had sunshine. The wind's blowing a gale and then the next minute is dead calm. And then the next minute it's blowing a gale again and the roof's nearly coming off. We've had no rain, but they forecast rain, but we didn't get it. So uh, <laughs> they can be wrong, apparently. But anyway, we've got a bloom that's sort of... Um, there's the wind blowing everything on the roof. Uh, that's sort of on schedule, really. Not doing anything unexpected, just um, doing its round. Now this one I actually got from Lynn. This one that she sort of said, um, here you are, you grow these, don't you? <laughs> and it's actually a, um, it's a cross. Um, so Miltonia, it's Candida species, and it's crossed with Binotii, which is a naturally occurring hybrid. Um, so effectively, there's three species in that, not two. Um, but nonetheless, it's, um, it's close to a primary cross. We've seen it before, it has bloomed before. Um, looks like it's going to have um, four or five blooms. This one's not quite open fully yet. The, the three sepals haven't quite peeled back yet. But it's a nice combination of colours. Um, you can hear me above the wind. I'll just see if I can get in nice and close. See if we can get the colour and the patterning on that lip. So that's number one. On schedule, as expected. But then we get a sneaky one because we look round and we think nothing's changed. And then I don't know whether you'll be able to see it, but out of the corner of my eye is a little bit of sort of pinky purple showing. Can you see it yet? Because I'm blowed if I saw it. If I hadn't picked the pot up to water it, I wouldn't have noticed it. And I'm not getting the pot, pot out to do a close-up, but it's in there. And that is Hibiki. And it's finally decided to push some blooms out. Oh, so, so I need three hands here to hold the leaves out of the way. As I say, I'm not getting the pot out. I just wanted to show that because there's quite a few buds on that cluster and two of them have only just started to open. So that will look better. Um, yeah. Sorry, I can Hector up my trouser leg. Um, and as such, I'll leave it at that. Just a little short one. It's, it's part of running a YouTube channel is showing the new blooms when they open and it is Miltonia time. You have to bear in mind the Miltonia sunsets just come out. We've now got this one and then up here we've got the uh, down here sorry we've got the Reginelli eye <laughs> and to see the spike on this plant you have to look through there because it's sticking up Stick it up through there. I'm going to have to move that or it's going to chop the blinking spikes off. And then we've got these two biggies here with lots of buds coming. So it's definitely Miltonia time. And when I was watering this the other day, this one's got buds as well. I think it's got two spikes. Yep, there's another one coming up there. So almost all of my Miltonias have currently got spikes or are opening blooms. So it's definitely the Miltonia time of year. And um, yeah, I mean, there's plenty more to come. Um, I mean, the spikes on these two up here are, are pushing up nicely. Um, you know, so we're gonna get quite a few blooms. Those are the two, what I'd call the two biggies. They're, they're the large plants. Reginellia is quite a big plant, but um, thinner leaves and fewer of them and slightly smaller pseudo bulbs, but coming on nicely. So, uh, yeah, Miltonia time of year, interrupted by a Dendrobium hippicky. <laughs> See you next time. Thanks for dropping by.